Like any other day, our T cell unit soldiers were eliminating cancer cells by identifying antigens on the cancer cell surface, binding their protein receptors, and injecting granzymes. Our unit always succeeded until cancer cells mutated to disguise themselves as unresponsive T cells and to have clusters of antigens. So, our T cell unit soldiers, now called the CAR T cell unit, was genetically modified to have chimeric antigen receptors, CARs. These CARs are able to identify and bind to B lymphocyte antigen CD19, even with the disguised and clustered antigens. Here's how to use your CAR. Attach the FMC63 single chain fragment variable or the binder to CD19. The binder is attached to the CD28 transmembrane domain, which is attached to the endodomain. The endodomain consists of CD28 co-stimulation domain and CD3 zeta. Once the binder binds to CD19, the transmembrane and endodomain will signal the activation of CAR. Once activated, your CAR will release perforin, making a pore on the cancer cell surface for you to inject granzymes, inducing the cancer cell to go through apoptosis. We're arriving at the body. As the body's own cells, the other cells won't attack us. Once you eliminate cancer cell, release cytokines to signal the immune system's other soldiers to come help. Now, you'll stay in the body, continually killing cancer cells and reproducing to keep the body safe. You got it? Now let's go, go, go!